Hello everyone, my name is Lorthorn and welcome to Minecraft's Tech Mods. This is going to be a series about going through all the tech mods that are in Minecraft 12 point... Sorry, 1.12.2. Well, not all of them, but there's about. I'm using the All the Mods Mod Pack 3, I think it's called? Yeah, All the Mods 3. It's a mod pack with a whole bunch of tech mods. We got, we got loads. Now you're not seeing many of them, but we got we got industrial craft, we got immersive engineering, we got we got embers, which is a tech mod, we got thumbcraft, which is a tech mod, we got blood magic, which is a tech mod, we got Batania, which is a tech mod. Um, we also have industrial craft and one of the spaceship mods, I can't remember what it's called, and a few others, and uh, innovations, and I think the the one that starts with F. Uh, it. it like uses up all the space. Let's see. Uh, at if um, no, not F is thermal. We have a thermal. Yeah, we, that's a pistol craft. Where's thermal foundations? Yes, yeah, so we have thermal foundations. So we got a we got a whole slew of mods. And to help us along with that, we've got ourselves a Kashuk tome, which has all their books in here for free. Because some of these things you actually have to pay for or get. Ah, this is what I should have used for example. Yeah, we got also computer mods and woot and spell forge and stuff. No one cares about that. A few Cthulhu things. Uh, that's not technology. Where's the technology? Extra utilities. There we go. Some technology. We got the digital guide. We got draconic evolution cycles. Yeah, we got we got loads of stuff going on. So, um, nothing in here. And this is all I got. This place here. I made this because I wanted to have a fancy looking place for the intro. That's about it. But this is my house farm, and oh man, the surrounding area looks absolutely gorgeous. What's mainly gorgeous to me anyways about it is we've got this lovely little like indent into the mountains here that kind of spreads out into that darker forest and there's sort of like an open hilltop plain sort of dealio going on here. And I think that just looks really cool. And also we got this thing right next to us, which, oh my goodness, it's got Christmas lights on it. Well, just so you know, this is being recorded during the holidays. I had no idea that was a thing. Well, tis the season after all. Tis the season to be jolly and all that stuff. Still have New Year coming. Oh, pineapples, yes. So, what is the first technological mod we want to get done? Well, I think the first one we want to get done is the basics of Minecraft. However, I do happen to know that if there's some stuff hidden under there. So I'm gonna get myself the pickaxe. And once we got the pickaxe, then we can do a whole lot more. Ooh, a rock. What's this for? Uses. Um, hmm, has no uses. Small pile of tungsten dust. I thought it was a rock. Apparently it's dust. Oh, if I click on it, it leaves my inventory? Uh-oh. Um, everything's leaving my inventory if I click on it. All right, got fixed. The computer thought the alt key was stuck down for some reason. Just had to slam it a few times. Anyways, let's go get some wood so we can get crafting all that stuff started. Um, had a little altercation with some things, but that's all fixed now, so it's good. Um, I probably have the mod that lets me vein mine as well. Um, I don't know how to set that. It's fine though. Uh, Ah, excavation, modifier, or enchantment for your tools to be able to excavate. Ah, has it systemed. That's cool. All right, I'm gonna make a crafting table here. I'm gonna make a crafting station now. Um, I am not going to use Tinker's Construct. That's against the rules. Also, cheating is against the rules. I just have cheats on for bug fisting, but no Tinker's Construct because that mod is too good. Uh, so, yes. All right, we're playing with a set of rules. As far as I'll go, Thinker's Construct is, um, well, that over there, unless I need to do it, but I don't think so, because some mods make it so you have to do Thinker's Construct, because, like, stone picks and wood pickaxes just automatically stuck. Fuck. Suck. There we go. But I don't think this mod pack's done that. So we're, we're all good in those regards. Okay. There we go. We got the stone pickaxe of legends. Now, all I have to do is mine into that building. And hopefully, we will get a nice little boost jump start. Now, is it underneath one of these pillars, or do you have to mine into the center of it, like go down beneath? I think it's down beneath, yeah, okay. 
Here we go. So there's the crystal. We don't want to touch that. We instead just want to rub our grubby fingers all over here. Yeah. Is that, is that all we get? No. Okay, we got... Ooh, diamonds already. That is a pretty sweet N5 iron. Excellent. Now, just gotta get out of here with all these Christmassy decorations. It's a shame I should have started recording this sooner. So then we could have been much more Christmas appropriate. But, this, this here is only starting Christmas. Or not even Christmas. It's starting in the new year. So it doesn't matter. Um, right. We can get ourselves a pickaxe. And we can also get ourselves a sword. And we could get ourselves a chisel. Yay! No, no, I'm not going to do that. I'm not that much of a fool. Okay, I should make an axe as well. Oh, I'm not going to have enough sticks. Though. Oh, no, I do. Perfect amount of sticks. Okay. There we go. Make myself an axe. And then I can go cut down trees with that. I should eat some of this pineapple. It's a fruit. Get my fruitiness back up. You don't want to be unfruity. There we go. And I'm making a chest because I also don't think I have gravestone markers. So that's, that's something to be cautious of. Right. Going to get these tech mods right quickly started though. So we're going to need to get some copper. And that is pretty easily found. We're also going to need a furnace. So I should just grab some of the stone. Get rid of these lumps and bumps everywhere. We can get making a furnace right away here. So we can do a lot of smelting. Uh, I really do like Taker's Construct, but it's just so OP. Also, it's a little hard to start. Although we do have iron, which is a really, really nice start. But no, no, we're going to not use Tinkers because it's just too good. We have to earn this technology. Right. So this should be enough for a chest. I kind of hope it's a pink chest, but uh, it's not, not integrated entirely. Um, how do we do this? We want to go like that. There we go. Two furnaces. Uh, we'll go for a double wide chest. Why not? We could even go for three chests. I'm going to hold on to the rest of my wood. Clear grit. Oh, nice. I didn't realize that was a thing. Okay, let's put these chests down here and these furnaces down in here. And we got the copper pretty nicely started in this area. So, there was more copper. It got obliterated. Now I don't keep it. None of the resources I start with I can take. Uh, I mean, I could break down this house, but it's nothing, NATO, nothing van valuable. And if I happen to dig out of space, I obliterate it. Them's the rules. Okay, I need to get a mine going. When in doubt, dig a hole. That is Minecraft. And then every goal is a hole. And on the hole, you can get yourself a pretty good amount of resources. So... We're going to go do that. Ah, but look, it's already like a sort of factory. Have you seen this thing from the side? I know, I'm, I'm easily distracted here. Ooh, so easily distracted. But just look at that building. It's a factory, sort of. It's not a very good one, but I didn't want to go too out on it. I was just messing around, just making a kind of cool little starting building. So that's what that is. Right, and we're going to mine down here until we get to the rock level, which we have. Do we have auto jump on? It feels like we do. I thought I had that specifically and automatically turned off. But apparently he decided to turn itself back on. No wonder I was getting so confused. I was like, why am I auto hopping all over the place? But it turns out, it's just the the way that the settings were. I must have accidentally bumped it back on or something like that. Okay, and down and down into the deep. Who knows what we'll find beneath? Diamonds, rupees, golden ore, hidden in the mountain store. I tend to sing a lot, don't I? Hmm, well. Ah, uh, so lucky you. You get to be serenaded while you watch this video. About Minecraft's technologies. I don't got no technologies yet. It's going to take a while to start. Unlike the, um, what was it? The magic one. That jump started off wizardry. Minecraft wizardry. And that series jump started off vampirism. So, we yeah, had quite the head start with all that there. But this here, this is just starting from basics. Ooh, tiny coal. Tankle's actually very good. Uh, got ourselves a fine little mine here. Yeah, no, this series is going to take time to start up, but I kind of like that. I like the idea of starting a new series, starting something new. It, maybe it'll work, maybe it won't, who knows. 
But, see, here's the trick why I'm calling it the Technologies Mods. One reason I want to focus on technology is how it's going to make my own mod pack, which I still will do, just later. But, focusing on technologies. But, I was like, oh, maybe there's a mod pack that'll find it. And yes, it's all the mods 3. However, if I made a, I'm playing Minecraft all the mods 3, no one would care. Trust me, no one would care. They'd just go, oh, so I'm going to play all the mods 3. Okay, jolly good, I'll go do something else. But, if I am playing the old uh, technological mods saying, I'm going to do Minecraft tech mods, then all you suckers are going to click on and go, ooh, tech mods, interesting series, tell me more. And well, you'll you'll see what happens when with whatever that is. Unfortunately, don't have the. Unfortunately, don't have more player models, but that's. Oh my, a village! I'll go check that out. Do you even know about that? Um, yeah, we don't have the more player models, but if you haven't noticed, something's looking a little different here. Uh, yes, got a new skin. Uh, it's part way through the skin. I'm not sure if I'll keep the skin like this or keep going with its changes, but I happen to have a new skin. You know, I think more often than not, I've played Minecraft with a. Uh, these buildings around around Christmas time, and so these boxes are always Christmas boxes, for whatever reason, which I find deeply amusing. That is also excellent. Oh, having this building here is so good. And the steel axe, nice. But why this building is so good to have here is it gives us a hammer, and that's just a nice little starting item to get ourselves grabbed and goobered up. And they've got a whole bunch of buildings here. Is this a jam guy? Oh no, it's um, I want you to call it. This guy is the crystallizer. So on these places, you can like make coffee and stuff. Ah, oh, actually, I'm gonna learn the mod this time with all his pyram lasers and all that stuff. I'm going, I'm going to learn it. Yeah, you can't actually take any of the stuff from up there because it breaks. That's that's the way the mod's designed. It's like a demo room, but we're gonna learn stuff. Oh, what do we have here? Is this like a grapevine? Oh, that's so cool. We can get some grapes going on here. Um, no, I don't think any of them are ready, but this is a grape growing operation. And they got like a little forest here. And what's this here we got? Oh no, the lump and rocks got rid of the portal. No! The portal stone's meant to be here, not you stupid lump and rocks. Who decide what order things would load in? You messed up. You messed up and we don't have a portal in this town. I'll have to make a waystone. Hopefully they're not too expensive. Or are you? You're a druid. Man, druids look evil. Okay. So what we got of interest here. Oh, okay. This biome. Uh, Biomes and Plenty is having some weird configs. Oh, Elvis. Nice. Oh, this is a rubber tree forest. That is also so good. Oh, so, so, so good. This is actually like the best village we could ever hope for in black like a dollar's eyes. And we got uh, whatever this guy is, a music lover, I believe. And you're a jam guy. Nice, we got a jam guy as well. Do you have any jam chests anywhere, dude? No? Uh, that's cool too. Oh, no, you got one behind you. Oh, this is most, this is all the same jam. Mostly the same jam. Well, we're going to take the jam guy's jam because that's our jam now. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, no, we don't want to jump down this pit. Where's the way back home? This is a really... I love this world spawn that we've got started here. It's a good one. It's a goodie. It's definitely a keeper. And, oh my goodness, hello. There's some of the village down there as well. Well, I'm not checking that out today. We're getting back home before the monsters come out. What is this thing? A uh, Baneberry. I reckon this is poisonous. Yep. Oh, it's withering. Oh, even better. I was like, I bet that this is probably a really bad idea to eat. And I just had to go and eat it. Well, we can... Oh, withering can kill you. Good to know. Right, then. Well, luckily, we've got this whole set up. Yes, I also don't have keep inventory. Mod Griefian is turned off. But no keeping inventory for this boy. All right, let's, let's get the basics started. Let's get what you need to do to start some new technological Minecraftian. There we go. Everything's equipped back the way it was. Excellent. Uh, we want the Kashik Twom to read one of these books. Which book is it? 
no, 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 no. Ah, engineering's guide. Excellent stuff. Overview of resources. Um, treated wood. Right, we want to get the treated wood. But we can get the um, coal coke oven started up right away. Just get that whole process going. So that will be under simple machines. No. Or could be. Uh, power constructions. Where's where's coal coke? Is there a search option? Um, nope. Overview of resources. Um, coke oven. There we go. So that requires the coke bricks, which to make, uh, how do we make coke bricks? We need clay, stone, and sand. So those are some things to sort out and search for. We will need a shovel. We have a shovel. We have an ax. I can actually get rid of a whole bunch of this stuff. Excellent. This is a pretty good handful of stuff. I'm just going to test this jam because um, they have effects on you. Okay, this one is for going underwater. Excellent. Actually, I'm going to store that way. We'll find food along the way. All right, to adventure. We've got the house, we've got the gear. Now we just need the sand and the clay and all that stuff. And I believe that's even down here already. So we'll get the coal coke oven going in absolutely no time. Oh, this is all rough dirt. But what is this here? We got the clay already, nice. We got the... Um, gravel, which is also equally nice. We don't want it to, like, do that there. Okay, we're just going to solve that. I just guess, yeah, not suppose. I will. It's not even a guess. I'm going to do it. There's, there's no guesswork here. This is all 100% intrinsic knowledge of how to play Minecraft because I am a super genius. How much of this do I need? The Coke oven takes nine to make? What does it take? All right, so that'll create three. Um, oh, it's just clay and sand. I don't need the gravel. Good to know. Uh, but how much does the coke oven take size-wise? So overview of resources, coal coke. Um, it takes... Okay, so that is nine times three. That is 27. We're going to need a lot of clay. We're going to need tons of clay. I think I need two stacks of clay. Yeah, two stacks of clay and maybe two stacks of sand. I should have kept that jam on me. Oh well. Uh, we don't need the gravel. It doesn't, doesn't hurt to have it, but don't need it. I'm going to go and investigate over here. I just want some easy to get sand in this, these little lake valleys. It's not the easiest of substances to find, don't you know? Uh, twigs on the ground there. I do like that. It's a fun little start that this, all the mods can give you. Okay, there's a good patch of sand to work with. Is there any clay down? I just can't see. I really should have brought that jam with me. I, I even should have been thinking, oh, we're going to be doing water stuff. I was like, I want to hold on. Save onto that jam in case we ever do water stuff. And now we don't even have it. Okay, but we got a good patch of sand here. I think I need 30... Uh, what? I don't know how many sand I'll need, but... I'm going to get 64 sand, try to get additional 60 or so clay. Yeah, that sounds like good numbers to me. Ah, oh, I'm very happy I picked up this iron shovel. Makes things nice, quick, and easy. We can get this series trucking along, rolling off the shelves in nose time. Going to have the most technology you've ever seen. And there's going to be no cheating unless the game breaks. Them's the rules. Remember them. At your own peril. Um, yes. Okay, where is the clay? Okay, we've encountered the pit. The pits of potential drowning. Uh, the pit of lack of light. Alright, there is no clay in the pit. That's uh, duly noted. We do have friends in the pit, friends we don't want to be around, so we're going to leave the pit. Um, yes. You can keep the pit, friends, and we're going to go back up to the surface where we belong. 
So, goodbye, Pit. Goodbye. Right. So, up we go. Easy deasy like. All the way over this way. Ooh, flowers. I like flowers. Uh, if you can't tell, got like a little crown of them. Well, I also have a different crown, but that's my new crown. I had old crown flowers. Oh, blueberry bush. Can I take this with me? Um, no, too. Yeah, I can. Oh, sweet. Go on, get myself a blueberry bush. There we go. Go and plant blueberries by my home. Oh, I love blueberries too. This is actually perfect. Go and get all the blueberries growing. And what type of berries are you? Golden raspberries. Uh, we can. Can't pick those up, but we can. I believe take the base. No, it just turns into sticks. Okay, well, that's fine. We got the blueberries. And that's what counts on this adventure. Oh no, we got a golden raspberry sapling. Okay, that's good too. We just need some more clay. Ah, the ocean or lake thing. This might have clay in it somewhere. Uh, is that clay? Can't quite tell. That's clay. Nice. Not much clay, but it's a good step in the right direction. And as long as you keep a positive mental attitude, you can do wonders. All right, uh, way back home. Oh dear. Um, okay, no problem. We just need to climb up the cliff and we'll get out again. Okay, and the way back home is, I should keep that actually the note on me somewhere, point me back home. It's this way, right? Or am I super duper lost? Because we got that temple. Ah, there's the other temple. Okay, so our home should just be over the grassy knoll here. Yeah. Yeah, it, it, it should be, right? It should be. This way. Unless this is yet another one we've gone into? Can't even tell because I dingle binged about with them. Um. Oh. Oh no. That's yet another temple. Well then. Definitely gonna explore it. Um, yeah, we got we got friends here. Okay, come on, creeper. Tank the shot. Come on, you stupid skeleton. Come on. Nope. All right, we got this. There we go. And one more shot. One more arrow. Come on. Nice. All right. Ow. Um, you're going down, buddy. Man, skeletons hit like trucks. Oh, we got the music disc. Ha <laughs> ha! Victory! Um, oh, I'm hurting. Good thing we got blueberries on us. Okay. Blueberries. Eaten. And we are still alive. Um, despite my efforts to make it otherwise. We got, oh, we got a lot of star maps here, don't we? Hmm. Well, we can only have so many on us at one time. Uh, ooh, more iron. More bones. I'll definitely sort bones. There we go. Iron over sticks. Let's get out of here um, and find the way back home, I guess. Okay, so this isn't home. It is home this way. I know it's up on this biome somewhere, this like plateau thingy we got going on here. Just don't know which way. I suspect it's this way though. Oh my. Just past the skeletons, we're just going to have to juke them. Let them get into their own duel. Okay, creepers over there. That's fine. And... Um, there's the bridge. Hmm. Now this really is a problem. Um, I could turn back on the map. I could look at the map, actually. Nope. Uh, which one's the map? J. Okay. So my house is right there, and my little bridge is there, and I'm right here. So if I do a complete turnabout, and then run along this way, that's the way back home. Okay. Excellent. And see, that's how you use a mini-map. Not constantly being in your right-hand corner. No, that's lame. You have to, like, pause and look at it, do a little bit of triangulation, figure the whole thing out. And hopefully not die. Okay, we're going to eat some rice on the way back. Right, let's go. Going to dodge a skeleton. It's going to be so pro. Oh man, you're not going to believe it. This is the way you have to just get things done. 
Getting her done. Ow, as they say. Ow, 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 ow. What on earth is this? It's edible. Okay, I'll take it. Saffron? Safflower? Something like that. Don't really know. Away! Yeah, just the spiders and the skeletons. There's my house. Hello, house. Okay. We're back on track. Excellent. We're going to get things going good. I should go to the village and, like, raid them for more food, too. That's definitely on the metric of plans of things to do. But for now, we're going to go to bed. Up we go. Easy daisy. Sleep it time. Right. Well, we're going to leave it there for today. So thank you all so much for watching the video. And uh, I'll catch you all next time. So until then, goodbye. <laughs>